Hi guys, Dr. Nicole here. So we are gonna do yet another video in our Voyage to Vitality series. We are going to be focusing on the healthy foundation today. So what are we going to talk about? Ta-da! What is a cavity? Okay, so I'm gonna break out my whiteboard. We're gonna draw some Bob Ross happy teeth and we will explain what a cavity is, things to know that are important and how to prevent it. Okay, so let's get going. Okay, so let's talk about what is a cavity. Now, as you can see here, here is my beautiful, fabulous brow Ross tooth. Um, it's very happy, as you can tell. So let's talk about the different parts, and then we can talk about what the heck a cavity is and why I drew this Bob Ross happy tooth. So these little lines, these are the fibers that go around the tooth that then are held in, and bone goes around that, and that's how your tooth stays in your jaw. This beautiful purple line across, those are your gums. They're purple in this picture, just work with me. Okay, I only have so many marker colors. And then there are three areas of your tooth. There's the outside white part, that's called the enamel. Okay, very fancy. There's the center part of the tooth called the dentin. And then this right here, this pink thing, that is the nerve of the tooth, also known as the pulp for the WebMD people out there. Okay, so why does this matter and who cares? Well, it matters because what happens with a cavity is bacteria in your mouth literally burn a hole in the tooth. So let's talk about the process here. When you're, you know, a normal person, you're brushing and you're flossing perfectly as I know you do, especially when you watch our videos on how to do it. I know you are, but for the normal people out there who aren't brushing and flossing perfectly or were younger and didn't give two hoots about it, what happens is, is you left some plaque on your tooth, right? So your mouth, everybody's mouth has bacteria in it. And some types of bacteria will stick to this plaque and they'll eat it, okay? And when they eat the plaque, what they do is they literally poop out acid. Not a joke, it's called lactic acid. And it poop, it, the poop causes a hole to form on the side of the tooth. Now, the longer the plaque is there and the more acid that builds up, it causes the hole to get bigger and bigger and bigger. And once the hole reaches into the center of the tooth, AKA the dentin, bacteria from your mouth will then go into this and they will start to infect the center of the tooth and then they'll start to break down and beat up and damage the center of the tooth. What happens is, is you literally get a hole to form in the tooth, AKA a cavity, okay? The dental nerd word for, the, for a cavity is caries, all right? So if you ever heard of someone talk about that, that's what we're talking about, caries equals cavity. And the reason why it's called a cavity is because of the breakdown from bacteria cause a cavity or a hole to form in the center of the tooth that will eventually cause the entire outer structure of the tooth to break down and wreak havoc and damage and do terrible things to the tooth long term. Okay, so if anyone has any questions about this, would like to talk about it further, please feel free, give our office a call, but until then, keep on brushing.